A nice adjustable bench is something that every home gym or garage gym or whatever needs. It takes no time at all to install, to build, to set up, whatever. There is one bar right there, kind of pops in place. And then there's another one right here to lock this into place, wherever you, however you want to adjust it. And then there's this giant hand screw tightener to mount this to the leg itself. And that is literally all the installation that is required, right? Now I'm using on this padded floor, but if you have a, uh, like a hardwood floor or something like that, there is levelers you can use to adjust the level of the bench. And of course the bench is pretty adjustable. You just pull this pin right here. The seat adjusts up or down. You can pull this pin right here. The back brace goes up or down. And obviously you can use this for your standard chest exercises, you know, a flat bench press using some dumbbells or barbells, kettlebells, whatever. You can put it at an incline to do your upper chest and a shoulder workout. And you can put it at a decline to work your lower chest, though my legs are a little long for this bench at six foot four. It does work okay. You can also use this for a good number of other exercises. A full body workout that you could do could be something like a sitting shoulder press into a bench press. That works your shoulders and your chest muscles. You can do a bent over row. That'll work your back. You could use it as a squat box, which is what I do a lot of the time. Helps you bang out a little bit more reps in a squat. Of course, a proper squat rack might be better for heavier weights. And you might say, oh, you could just do this on a dining room chair. Yeah, but you know, can a dining room chair take you putting all of your weight on it over and over and over again while holding some weights? You might upset your spouse or your parents or whatever if you break the dining room chair. And one of my favorite movements, the Bulgarian split squat. This movement is amazing. It's a little difficult, a little bit complex. Try it with body weight only before you add weight to it, but you can absolutely do a full body workout. We've got a decent home gym. I should have bought this thing sooner.